Hey Collective, it's your girl Mermaid Prophetess bringing you another collective reading. Let's see what's going on my beautiful Divine Feminines, my beautiful Divine Masculines. Let's see what's going on with the collective energy today. Please keep in mind that energy can be past, present, or future. So take what resonates and discard the rest. Alright, so let's see what's going on. We have your, per your perfection in reverse. And we have father wounds. This is giving me Divine Feminine... You could have been in a situation with your divine masculine here. And you could have, you could have actually walked on a tight line. Um, divine feminine. So this resonates with, I feel like at some point you really walked on eggshells in this situation um, with this divine masculine. I feel like you did that in effort to try to salvage uh, this situation. I feel like you tried to be perfect here. And the thing is, it, it was like divine feminine, no matter how well you brought it, no matter how much you did, no matter how much work, no matter how hard you tried, no matter how hard you fought for this situation, because this masculine is wounded here, this, this masculine, he could have mother wounds or father wounds, or this could just be wounds, um, from other masculines. I mean, even with these wounds, this could be um, something that manifests within him that is very toxic. This masculine could be very toxic. Um, he does not make good decisions. And no matter how perfect you were, no matter how much uh, of a solution, I don't know why I want to say solutions that you brought to the table, no matter what you did, no matter the effort, it was never going to be good enough in this situation because this, this divine masculine, because of his own need for healing, because of his own need to love himself enough to step it up, this masculine, he couldn't see you as perfect because it's like you had to be knocked down. You, It's like you had to be brought down a notch for his behavior to actually make sense in this situation because the truth is you brought a very angelic energy a very pure energy an energy that had like there was no doubt about your intentions in this situation okay who we channeled a lot there i don't know like out the gate divine feminists y'all know it's a collective reading say what resonates and discard the rest let's get one more yeah Look at that. We have emotional intimacy. This is in reverse. We have spoiling you. This is in reverse. This is a masculine who it's like he found excuses to continue to behave this way, to continue to not give you what you deserve to with equal give and take. Even though this masculine knows you're my soulmate, even though he felt a divine connection, but this masculine did everything he could to sabotage, everything he could to justify his in and out behavior. He did all of this. And, ref and what it is, is this is a masculine who refused to face his own demons. Okay? Come through spirit. I wasn't expecting all of that, but that ain't be. That's where we ended up. Okay? Let's see. What else is going on here? Come through. Okay, you guys, energy can be masculine or feminine. Please flip the roles as it makes sense for your situation. Let's see what else is going on here. Okay, let's see one more. All right, we have Pluto energy at the bottom. The need for control of an obsession with a power struggle. So there's some kind of power struggle going on right now. Somebody's trying to take control of something here. We got Pisces energy here comes showing up behind this Pluto energy. So Scorpio Pisces energy, water heavy in this heavy already opening up this reading. Even with emotional intimacy that gave me water energy that actually gives me cancer energy because cancer energy is very uh, mothering. So you, you could have tried to save this masculine. Whatever's going on in this dynamic here, there's a power struggle. Somebody had an obsession with your dreams. This person is overwhelmed. There's a power struggle. Somebody's lost control, period. Okay, see that? There we are, Pluto, Pisces energy, Scorpio energy in the Pluto. Okay, so there's some kind of power struggle. Somebody is overwhelmed. They're overwhelmed by your personal power. Okay, with the eighth house showing up, more Scorpio energy. So definitely a lot, I mean, really, tough water energy right because it's like we got a fine cancer energy but it's tough water like energy especially double scorpio opening up 
major transformation. Somebody, look at that. I was just talking about cancer. And look at that. Huh. Cancer energy, intuition to protect. You could have known that you needed to protect yourself from something here, Divine Feminine. Somebody's going through some kind of power struggle. I just saw a rubber band snap back in my mind. And it's, uh, somebody didn't expect this to pop. Something popped. Okay, we have Libra, big Libra justice energy showing up here. This Libra energy talks about cooperate, cooperation to perfect decisions about somebody. Some, there's a power struggle in cooperation. Somebody is overwhelmed in their emotions because something is not fair. Whoever this divine masculine is, he could be in a situation where he feels like he's being treated unfairly. He could have put himself in this situation where he feels like he's being treated unfairly. Hold on, let's pull these out. Okay. Yeah, wow. Open it up. Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, all three water signs. I'm telling you, somebody's in their feelings. But then with Libra capping that off, man, this is like something to do with justice. There was decisions that were made. Didn't I say that this masculine has a thing for making bad decisions? Hold and on, I was guys. talking about how this masculine made a decision before. And something about this decision kind of led to a power struggle, especially with this cancer energy. It says attitudes from the past about something about the way this masculine, like his attitude towards a karmic situation that involves you, divine feminine. It's like he has a new attitude about this. Um, it, it's this decision that he made. It's like this got him in his feelings. Okay, even with the Herald, it talks about small regrets. I feel like a regret turned out to be, um, it's like this Maslin didn't expect that he would regret this decision this much. He thought that this would be a small regret, but now there's a power struggle. Come through spirit. Okay. Let's see. What is going on? Who we? Let's see. What's going on? Okay. Yeah, something about his legacy. We even went parenthood being here. We got taking control in reverse. Something led to the catalyst. That could be karmic, a karmic parent involved here. A karmic mother, karmic father. There was somebody that was in control here. This is like a captain or something like that. Um, somebody felt like they were the captain of your ship. There's a team here. And they're, they're led by somebody in this parent energy in a in some kind of karmic controlling energy because we're talking about somebody that tried to create radical changes in your life in this situation this divine masculine could realize that whoever this karmic uh parenthood energy this karmic teamwork there's a leader here with parenthood the captain teamwork there's some kind of follow the leader dynamic here there's a power struggle there this masculine could be standing up to this person. Somebody hit their last catalyst, okay? Somebody's recognizing that there were some other influences with new influences here. Somebody's trying to get control of this situation. With this catalyst card, it talks about taking control. Somebody's trying to get control of this situation. Yeah, they're determined to get control of this situation. Somebody refused to give up trying to control this masculine okay this masculine could literally there's it's like push and pull i'm just saying like somebody pulling the rope this way pulling the rope that way it's like this is this is overwhelming somebody is really in their feelings about this a person who was hiding their true self with this mask energy and with this determination and certainty somebody definitely thought they had control of this situation come through spirit cool let's see what else is going on yeah, somebody here, something, something's going on with finances or somebody paid someone to, I mean, we got, we got the patron and we have the assassin in reverse. Okay, Divine Feminine, so let's get it. Yeah, there's somebody who went, wanted to straight attack you, period. Look at that. We got Vengeance, the patron and an assassin. A storyteller, come through spirit. A storyteller who didn't pay attention to the details. We got the tailor and the gambler. Yeah, there could be a community involved here with the tailor and the gambler here. Come through. So this is giving me divine feminine. Somebody could have paid for some kind of death magic, for some kind of 
even a physical assassin, somebody paid could have paid to unalive a person here for some of you divine feminines or for somebody to destroy somebody's finances here. But with this patron and assassin here, somebody went to someone to get another person attacked, divine feminine. This is somebody, they're going through a power struggle because this is somebody that wanted to attack you. The founder of this group, okay. Come through, spirit. Yeah, they took a risk here. This storyteller, a karmic storyteller, they've been showing up no matter what deck I use. Literally, no matter what deck I use. This person tried to tailor an image about you or they felt like they had all the details when it came to you. This person took a risk and now they're experiencing nothing but loss. There could be an Aries involved. Come through, spirit. <laughs> okay. Oh, let's see. What else is going on here? What else? Because these people, man. Let's see. What cards do I want to use? Let's see. What else is going on here? Baby. This is like Divine Feminine. You really brought it here. When it comes to you showing up like that, it's like... Whoever this masculine is, he would never be able to see how much perfection you brought. He would never be able to see, and nobody's perfect, but this is almost like you went out of your way consciously to try to always do the right thing here. Okay, something shocking has happened here. Let's see, what is going on, country spirit? Let's see. What is going on here? There's a power struggle. Somebody can't get control of this situation anymore. This person that wanted vengeance against you, they wanted a war against you, and now they can't overcome this. Okay, yeah. That assassin was in reverse, so this didn't happen. Come through, what's going on? Okay. Look at that. I'm trying to tell you, Divine Feminine, look at this. All you see is love, in and out, and ignoring you. What did I say? Didn't I say this masculine was in and out? No matter what, and you, it's like you tried to understand where this masculine was coming from. You could have even tried to, my ear is itching. You could have even tried to diagnose this masculine, okay? You could have even tried, like even when things were bad, you were trying to like convince yourself, I'm gonna make this right, I'm gonna make this right. You tried here, but it didn't matter. Your efforts went unnoticed here, or this is how you felt in during this time period, Divine Feminine. But this was unrelated to you. This masculine is, whew, there's a lot of damage here on this masculine. This Divine Masculine, who that Divine is deep. It's deep. Look at that, seeking guidance. Somebody's secretly getting readings on you, come through. Seeking guidance and pacify. There's a secret about this. Come through, spirit. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Talk about cards that don't belong. We got I love you. And then we have always fighting, seeking guidance, and pacify. Come through, spirit. This is giving me, there could be a karmic lover here who's getting secret readings or another karmic attachment that's getting secret readings or asking people about you, divine feminine. This person is always fighting with this masculine about you, about how he feels about you, how he speaks on you. He could be comparing you to this person. We're seeking God. There's somebody here that this person secretly talks to or this person secret. They found out something here about this masculine's emotions towards you. And this led to a fight. Somebody, they feel like this masculine is hiding his emotions. Always fighting, sneaky, come through spirit. Okay, yep. Huh. Look at that sneaky energy. Somebody took off, yeah. <laughs> Take off the cover up, look at that. Take off the cover up, okay. <laughs> okay. They felt like this masculine is hiding it. Somebody got really upset. This person, it's like they had, somebody had a serious problem with this masculine's emotions towards you. It's like this masculine could be going through some kind of awakening here and it's leading him to speak more of you. These people are always fighting about you, a divine masculine and karmic lover. And not to mention, we're like, oh, we got to get to this assassin energy. We got to get to it. Here, give me a couple more of these. We got to get to it. What else is going on? 
What else? Look, dirty and messy. This is in reverse. Look at that. Last chances. Everything that this karmic assassin energy did, they had one last chance. One last chance to leave a chosen one alone with chosen showing up. I put, I had a reading, I can't remember how long ago, but it wasn't too far. Um, probably like maybe about five or six readings ago where a karmic uh, assassin energy, this is like some kind of death energy that somebody was sending out. They had one last chance to leave a chosen one alone. They had one last chance and they would have had happy days ahead if they would have just dropped this. But this person refused to let this go. Yeah, now it's reached its boiling point. They refuse to let it go. Come through. Okay, what else is going on here? It's a sense of somebody patron, uh, and like even with this seeking guidance here, I mean, this is, this could even be an occultist who's also a reader. Or this is somebody who practices art, spiritual arts, dark arts, where over here by pacifying, always fighting. Somebody could have wanted to shut your mouth, Divine Feminine, because you spoke the truth, or they're afraid that you're going to speak the truth here about somebody trying to take you out, about an assassination, about somebody getting vengeance against you because, because you were just existing. This person is dirty and messy. This patron, this person that went to this occultist, this spiritualist, I don't know why Santeria is coming to me. Hoodoo is coming to me. Somebody was taking notes here. Somebody could have been learning, learning from a kitchen witch here. This is somebody who patroned somebody to actually try to take somebody out. Okay. Like actually, somebody actually paid money here. Okay. Their dirty, messy laundry is out. Somebody could have located notes about instructions on what to do to actually bring some kind of endings or death energy to a divine chosen way. Okay. What else is going on here, spirit? Come through. Because I can't already. They wasted time and they keep trying. I'm telling you, they're looking into this divine feminine. This fake person is so stressed out. They can't believe it. When I say they can't believe it, look at this person. Look at this person. Falsehood, try again, wasting time, late night scrolling. This is somebody that is obsessively watching you, obsessively looking up different practices to use against you, to cover you with some kind of dark energy. They keep wasting their time. They keep wasting their time. They keep trying again. That's why I said they had one last chance to leave a chosen one alone. Now this is becoming stressful. Look at this. This is becoming stressful. This person got a message come through. Incoming call? They got a, a shocking message with incoming call and shocking. This person is stressed out. People are gossiping about this. With gossip being here, chit chats, hidden tweets, people are talking about this. There could be a, so people who are on social media that are involved in this. Come through spirit. They were wasting their time. Now this person is so stressed out. They got the message. They got the message that they couldn't cover it up. They couldn't cover up that they were putting thoughts in somebody's mind could be this masculine's mind. They couldn't cover this up with incoming call to cover up, putting thoughts in their mind. This man, somebody could have called this masculine and let him know what was up. They took a risk here. This storyteller tried to cover it up and they lost. People are talking about it. This gossip is reaching an all time high. This person is surprised. With surprise and boiling point, they are surprised that this has reached this all time high. Damn, come through spirit. Okay, let's see, let's get one more over here. I'm trying to tell you, it's troubles ahead. Look at that. Look at that, come through. Yeah, troubles ahead for this shady person. Literally, with troubles ahead, advice, boiling point. And then we have Shady showing up here. There are two gossip queens with two phones, two karmic energies. These people are sitting here on the phone because everything is reaching their this boiling point. They could be discussing these troubles that they're facing. Two shady people having this conversation about how things are not changing for their favor, changing in their favor. This is not going well. 
They're scrolling all night. They're shocked. This is shocking information. They didn't expect to have troubles ahead. Somebody didn't expect to get ghosted. Okay. Comfy spirit. Okay, let's get some tarot on the table. Okay. <laughs> Child, I cannot. I cannot. Not somebody actually patron an assassin. Somebody could get uh, convicted here for trying to assassinate somebody here. This assassin energy also says convictions. Look at that. Nine of swords. This assassin energy is on their knees. Seven of coins. It's heavy. It's a slow burn. What's going on here? Comfy spirit. Okay. Yeah. Let's see. Give me that assassin energy over there before I get to clarifying these other energies here. Assassin and patron. Vengeance. What's going on, spirit? Okay. Because I cannot. Yeah, they paid somebody. Somebody paid someone so they could come out of the cold. So they could get out of like being put away somebody could have gotten uh left or like somebody um this could even be this divine masculine circled back to a karmic ex or something like that or somebody paid some money to try to get back in someone's presence here okay with knight of coins five of coins in reverse or somebody paid some money come through spirit to make sure that you would never come out of the cold or that it would be a slow process for you to get back on your feet. Come through spirit with the knight of coins and the five of coins in reverse. They wanted to make sure that you would always have to fight for this, to get on your feet, to be successful. Somebody wanted you to lose your footing. Yeah, so you would not be independent. So you would not have balance. So you would not be resourceful. Oh, goodness. Okay. Okay. Huh. I keep saying the hangman too. Okay. Yeah, they wanted to control this. But look at this power struggle. Emperor in reverse, Knight of Swords, Big Aries energy. Look at that power struggle. Somebody can't take control over you. Control over this situation. They've lost it. They've lost it. Yeah, this person is emotionally like, this person is pissed. And I was seeing that. Even with that always fighting early on in the reading, it was very clear that somebody is like just emotionally all over the place. These karmic energies that are having a power struggle with the divine masculine. They're, they're very upset. This karmic assassin energy, this person that was patronizing others, somebody could be, ooh, come through spirit. Somebody could literally be visiting multiple spiritualists, multiple occultists, multiple readers, just patronizing multiple, multiple people trying to do this to you. This person is on a rampage. Knight of Stabs in reverse, Page of Cups in reverse. This person is childish. This person is petty. This person is literally going around. I'm trying to tell you, look at that. Six of Pentacles offering money to try to assassinate you, Divine Feminine. Yeah, this is why this was their last chance. Okay. There could be a team of people here involved. This was all about trying to take control. Now there's a power struggle amongst a, a team. Somebody lost all of their power. Yeah, they should have they should have been they they should have been focused on protecting themselves. That's what they should have done here. Because of that big Libra energy capping off this row right here is it's a done dot. <laughs> Baby. You want to see this one? Like, that's the last place you want to see them scales. At the end of the reading, oh, that means this whole thing is turning around on you. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. It could be karmic mother, karmic father involved here. Somebody tried to take command of your life, take command of your union. They wanted to take control. Three of wands sideways, something didn't work. It's like something, they felt like something halfway worked, but then you healed? Yeah. So, like, you didn't take the bait, Divine Feminine. Somebody thought that you would take the bait. I don't know why I'm getting that. With the star upright, Aquarius energy, three of wands coming up sideways, and the fool in reverse. You didn't take the bait, so now somebody's afraid. A group of people are afraid because you didn't jump when they thought that you would jump. Falsehood. They thought, somebody thought that they could make your laundry dirty and messy or something like that. Come through. Yeah, you didn't you didn't you didn't take somebody's command here, Divine Feminine. Yeah, this was the catalyst. 
this is what come through spirit. This is what changed everything. Now this person is, this group of friends are afraid. This group of friends includes a karmic lover. It could be five people here. When there's four stats with two people on this card, three of cup, karmic friends involved here. They're getting the message that they have no protection from the Empress because the Empress has called judgment. Come through spirit. You, you walked away from this energy and just gave it to God? With the Eight of Cups, the Empress, you blew the horn. Divine Feminine, you blew the horn on this situation. Come through. Okay. You blew the horn here. Scorpio Sagittarius, Taurus, Leo energy. Okay. Taurus over here as well. Aries. Yeah, there's a group of people that are very much so afraid with the Three of Cups and the Fool in reverse. They're very much afraid. These karmic storytellers, they don't know what to say now. Somebody can't explain something. They can't explain why they did all of this just to try to control a situation. Okay. Come through, spirit. Okay. Yeah, there's a power struggle here. Somebody wants to, it's like a, a group is eating each other alive or something like that. They were obsessed with you. They were obsessed with needing to control this situation. Or this masculine is finding out how obsessed these people were. Because the need to try to control you, Divine Feminine, was all based on the need to try to control or to control, continue to control this masculine. Somebody could have had their a grip on him for a very long time. For some of you, Divine Feminine, this is like two totally separate situations going on. Where, I don't know why I'm getting that, like where there is some kind of... Uh, energetic attack here or something going on where like through a divine masculine or not so divine masculine okay like everything is itching me now and for some of you it's like there's some other attack here going on you call judgment on multiple things you're the star the empress is called judgment with the three of wands sideways divine feminine it's almost like something happened where you lost uh your footing or something happened where they felt like you showed some kind of weakness or something like that. They thought you ha they had you here. But you call judgment. These three people are done. Three of Pentacles in reverse. What I said, these people don't even like each other anymore. Come through. The Fool and the Three of Cups in reverse. There's a group of people that's afraid. What's going on there? They're afraid. There's a power struggle. Yeah, oh, they're mad. They're afraid because, God damn, it's like they are being feasted on by their own beast. Okay, oh, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. Okay, look at this. Knight of Swords and the Hangman. Somebody can't move while they're being devoured. Somebody is li being literally being ate up alive. Somebody, like, literally. Okay, somebody could eat some, like, really, really bloody, bloody meat to the point where they're, like, Oh my God, I don't know why I'm getting that. It's like somebody could, uh, ugh. It's, it's like they could, like, let's say, you know, everybody eats their steaks different. This is like, I don't know why I'm getting this. This is so crazy. Okay, somebody could like, there could be a group here, a, a ritual even, with this devil and the, and the swords. Somebody could have like barely sauteed some kind of bloody meat and and just like started drinking the blood of this like it, it's oh my god somebody's doing some kind of blood magic something is eating this person up a group of friends they're all afraid because they see somebody's being made an example of by the devil because they are in some kind of somebody's in some kind of blood contract with the devil Okay, there's something here with the lovers, Gemini energy. This was about a two of cups situation. This was a plan that was executed to make sure no effort was placed into a two of cups soulmate connection. These are people who watched. Watched to make sure this situation gets dropped. These are people who are now on their knees. Five of cups. They regret this. The word regret is over here too. Hmm. Oh my goodness. This is like... A group of people are being forced to watch somebody be get like eaten up or, or like terrorized or something here. Like by karma, uh, by karmic justice. Damn. 
a group of friends, a group of people. This could even be a coven. These people are afraid because they have trapped themselves in some kind of soul contract with the demon. Somebody is afraid that they trap themselves in a soul contract with the demon. This could even be this divine masculine could have trapped himself in a soul contract with the demon. He could be finding that out that this is somebody who dabbles in um, blood magic or something like that. That three of cups could also be a third party here. Somebody's trying to rebuild themselves. A king of staffs. Okay. Devil energy, Capricorn. Pisces, Capricorn energy here. Somebody is being like held still. What? Somebody could have wanted to hold you down, Divine Feminine, while you get attacked. Somebody don't want you to be able to move. Could even be sleep paralysis here or something like that. It wants you to be held still. A group of people. These people are now afraid. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Damn. Whoo. Whoa. 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 Okay. Whew. All right. Let's approach this. Divine Feminine. Okay. So, they're a group. Okay. Take this how this resonates. This group is very much so afraid. They're afraid. Okay, with the full energy in reverse, three of cups. They're afraid. There's a power struggle. Somebody could have lost control of a spell. These are people who were obsessed with the obsess an obsession with the need for control of. We have a power struggle, this big Pluto energy that is like looming all over this reading. Okay, this is like, um, whew, look how this person is being held still. Like, they cannot move. Somebody wanted you to be held still, like held down, held tight, uh, restrained, so they could attack you without any consequences here. These are devils. For some of you, this is literally on a physical level where somebody actually wanted to make sure they paid someone here. I don't know who energy we tapping into right now. Damn. Oh, this is dark. They could have even paid somebody here in the 3D to try to have you like held still, held down and attacked or something like that. Some of the, oh my God, like I'm even getting somebody trying to follow you or something like that. Somebody literally patronized somebody to do this to you. For some of you, this is energetically, they want to slow you down so you wouldn't be able to recover from something, whether that is your health, uh, whether that is your finances, or whether that is your heart, or whether that is even spiritually, they want to make sure that you wouldn't recover from something. I keep getting like phone calls. I keep getting a lot of distractions. Like something like, it's, mm -mm. I'm, I'm not even breaking out of this energy right now. We're going to get through this reading. This is like somebody wanted you to be trapped and attacked. These people are now afraid, these karmic energies, because they have trapped themselves. And not only have they trapped themselves, they, they are literally being attacked. They are being attacked by a demon or by the devil or some kind of dark energy. Um, this is all backfired. These people are afraid. They are afraid because of this karma that is coming for what they tried to do to you, what they tried to call on to you, Divine Feminine. They regret this. Everything, what they tried to put out here on you, this was rejected. The ability for them to have you physically assaulted here in the 3D, physically put down. This is an assassin. This is ruthlessness. Somebody could actually go to jail for this. I said this earlier. <laughs> Like, somebody could actually go to jail for this. Because this, let me show you. This assassin energy also says what? Conviction. It also says conviction. For some of you, you may find out later. Like, huh, some time from now. And this comes out because of some other investigation. I don't know why I'm getting that as well. Uh, that somebody found notes. Remember, we saw notes, um, a plan, some a written plan to have you assassinated, assassinated. You may even, you might even get like a a well check out of nowhere, or somebody checking up on you 
out of nowhere. For some of you, you got people reaching out to checking up on you out of nowhere as if there's some kind of energy or message out there that something's wrong with you. Okay? Like, who? Let's get into these. <laughs> Let's go further. Okay? Come through, Spirit. Because I cannot right now. I cannot. Okay, let's get into this. This power struggle. They had an obsession with this need to try to control you. And now this has led to a, a power struggle with their with their own the own energies that they tried to put out. Look at that. It, it never left them. Six of Swords in reverse, four of pentacles. It's like they tried to free this demon upon you, and the demon never left. Look at it, it's just stuck. Just stuck. Sitting. Six of Swords in reverse, it came right back. Right back. I cannot. I cannot. They're angry. There's a narcissist that's angry about this. When I tell you, I mean, who y'all seen how that just slid? I'm going to show you exactly what's going on over here. Come through, spirit. Justice in reverse. Eight of Wands. When I tell you that energy, Eight of Wands showing up. While we're looking at the Six of Swords in reverse, Four of Pentacles, we're talking about this need to control this energy that they sent out. Divine Feminine, Eight of Wands. This energy went nowhere. Being with the Four of Pentacles being here, Six of Swords, it just came back. There's a King of Swords that's confused and he got his arms in the air. Hands up. Hands up. Somebody could be being told, hands up. Five of Swords. These are people that felt like they could defeat you. They're confused why they have not defeated you. There's a King of Swords that's on a rampage here, trying to figure out how this didn't work. Huh, baby, this ain't nothing but karmic justice with the justice in reverse. This is justice, okay? Libra energy again, Libra energy caps off the row. Come through. They can't believe they don't have control of this situation. They don't believe they don't have control of this masculine or this masculine don't believe that. He can't believe he don't got control of this situation. Finding out that somebody is shady. Feeling like these people are changing on him. Took advice. Now there's troubles ahead. Okay, come through, Spirit. Somebody was hiding the fact that they knew someone was visiting in a cultist. And this person, somebody finding out, there's a masculine finding out why a karmic attachment keeps starting fights about you. Finding out that they have always been getting these readings or talking to somebody looking for information on you. This person had one last chance to leave you alone. Let's see what's going on. Somebody's overwhelmed at what's going on. Somebody's overwhelmed by a dream that they had. A king of wands in reverse, a karmic masculine. Okay, he could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, or has a strong placement. This person is overwhelmed because they had a dream. They did not like this dream. Yeah, somebody could have dreamt a repeat cycle of death with death in reverse, three of swords in reverse. Like a very painful, repet somebody's having a painful, repetitive dream of something being like unleashed on you or something like that. Whoa. Okay, what's going on? Wheel of Fortune. So somebody, I'm trying to tell, look at that. Come through, spirit. King of Stags, King of Wands in reverse, Wheel of Fortune. It's like he's having some kind of dream about his karma. He's overwhelmed. Somebody's overwhelmed with karma. They realize the type of karma that they're going, that they're getting. A karmic masculine. This could be your not so divine masculine. Yeah, for for something to do with a cycle in the past. This is a cycle with you. The world, six of cups, torpy, 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 torp, top, 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 Toby, top, Tony. NY, NY could be significant here. Nine, 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 I don't, I don't know. I don't know why I'm getting all of this right now. Six of cups in the world, okay? Let's see. Double on the Sagittarius. Somebody could have fire and water placements in their chart, okay? Number 10 could be significant here. Let's see. What's the, what's the wheel of fortune? Something's changing. Yeah, something's changing with all of this deception. 
Seven of Swords in reverse. Five of Swords. Ace of Cups in reverse. Everybody knows that. Okay, there's a karmic masculine. People is overwhelmed because a hey, people know what this person did, what this masculine did, or there's a masculine who's realizing that he should have listened to you about your dreams. Could have listened to another masculine instead. Somebody is overwhelmed with what they see coming towards them. Now that all the deception is out in the open, and now that they realize that there is no wish fulfillment without this Ace of Cups, Nine of Cups in reverse, Ace of Cups in reverse. Something was always a mind game. Somebody was always playing mind games, putting thoughts in someone's mind. Or somebody was trying to gaslight you. There's a master gaslighter here. There's a karmic masculine who is not getting a wish fulfillment. Play, he played games, sacrificed an ace of cups. Come through, spirit. Okay, let's see here. Let's see here. That could even be something about a miscarriage here. You could have an idea about a pregnancy, divine feminine, or a, about a miscarriage. You know something about this. You know something changed here. There's some kind of deception here. Let's see. Huh. Queen of Cups in reverse, two of swords. So that could be a karmic masculine and a karmic feminine who thought that you wouldn't see her for what she is. Seven of Wands and the Two of Swords thought that you wouldn't see her impacts in trying to make sure you lose a wish fulfillment or she didn't expect a masculine to see what she, her involvement in missing out on this Ace of Cups. Somebody was hiding behind the scenes. Their involvement, their messages. This could be a karmic family member. Somebody, there could be a, a really expensive car accident, even a total loss here. Somebody's pissed off about this. Somebody lost a lot of money, a lot of abundance. Ten of coins in reverse, the chariot in reverse, cancer energy, queen of swords in reverse, four of cups. Everything was rejected. Something was rejected that has to do with a large sum of money. They're overwhelmed. Somebody's overwhelmed with what happened with the large sum of money. Come through, spirit. Too many cards. A magician in reverse. Somebody manipulated this. They got an occultist. An occultist came out of nowhere? An occultist from, from the internet. With the world being here. There could be an online occultist that's a part of this. Or something like that. This person is overwhelmed. They're having dreams about what's coming towards them. They could be trying to find a way to protect themselves from this. Because there's a group of people that's afraid here. Come through, spirit. Okay. Whew. Let's keep going. Intuition to protect. Attitudes from the past about. Somebody did not think that they needed to protect themselves when they were doing this. They didn't think that this was going to come back to them. Cancer energy. What's going on here? Ace of Swords sideways. They thought they would be victorious. Yeah, they were not ready. Four of Swords in reverse. Now this person can't get no sleep. Yeah, because the world is here. Everything is coming full circle. Ace of Swords sideways. Somebody who tells half truths. Somebody told a half truth. Come through. Somebody thought they were going to be victorious. They made a decision about you in the past. This could be somebody who lied to you a lot, especially with that Ace of Swords sideways. This could be a gaslighter here. There could be a Divine Masculine not getting any sleep. Ignored his intuition to protect himself. Ignored, had a nasty attitude about something in the past, Divine Feminine. A truth you told. Somebody could have tried to make it seem like you were lying. Ace of Swords sideways. You knew the truth about needing to be protected. This person didn't know the truth. Or they rejected the truth. Ace of Swords sideways. Somebody thought they were going to be victorious, but now they're stuck. Yeah, somebody thought they were going to be victorious going against you, whoever this dark priestess is. But you healed. They thought that they would be able to keep you burdened. Page of Swords in reverse. They've been watching you to see if you would get this Ace of Coins. Make sure you didn't get a wish fulfillment. A Queen of Staffs in reverse. There's so many people here. Ace of Swords sideways. Ten of Swords in reverse. Yeah, this person, somebody thought, like, it's like this person didn't think that you would recover here. I was pulling that, I think, on my last reading. 
where somebody didn't realize that you would recover, a dark priestess. They thought that you would stay burdened. High priestess in reverse, Pisces energy, 10 of wands. Yeah, somebody kept watching, kept getting readings on you, kept looking for information on you to make sure that you stay burdened. They wanted you to be so burdened in a two of cups situation till it cracks. Okay. Ace of Wands, you came out with a new beginning. You have new beginnings in front of you, Divine Feminine. High Priestess in reverse. Didn't see something, didn't think something was capable of healing. Thought that they had the victory. This Dark Occultist. Yeah, it's like somebody thought that you wouldn't be able to defeat them. You defeated somebody here. Five of Wands in reverse. There's no competition. Somebody who tried to compete where they don't compare. This is somebody who is after your divine inheritance. Ten of coins in reverse. Now this person is losing everything, including the tires on their car. I don't know why I'm getting that. They have no independence. This person is out of control. There could be a married couple that's a hater of yours, divine feminine, or couples here that are against you that went against you. There's a bunch of infighting about some money that's just not even there anymore. Somebody could have wasted all this money already and these people are fighting over this money. Somebody wasted money into a very expensive purchase here and this purchase is down the drain. Somebody invested everything that they got into a situation. This could have been this um, not so divine masculine. Invested everything that he got into a situation financially. And this is who this going to piss him off. Uh, this is going to lead to a lot of infighting. High priestess in reverse. A dark occultist got defeated. Didn't expect you to heal so quickly. What's going on? She's burdened, and now she can only watch? Yeah, she's burdened. She can only watch, look at that. 10 of wands, page of swords in reverse, and the queen of coins. She can only watch you get your coins, get your stability. Now she's burdened because she sees that you've healed. This is karma. Justice in reverse, again, this is her karma. This is definitely the occultist. All of the seeds that she planted against you, Divine Feminine, were rejected. Magician in reverse, seven of, seven of Pentacles in reverse, four of Cubs. Everything that, everything that a masculine did towards you has backfired on him. I'm getting that as well. There were several people that needed to protect themselves in this situation. It could be a warlock and a female occultist here. Gemini Aries energy, seven of pentacles in reverse. All the seeds they planted went nowhere. Okay. Yeah, they didn't realize that they needed to protect themselves here. Come through spirit. Cooperation to perfect decisions about, decisions about cooperating with this union, cooperating with this divine contract. Come through spirit. Okay, so this divine masculine, that's the decision. Look at that. The lovers in reverse? Okay, Libra energy, cooperation to perfect. No coincidence here, we have your perfection in reverse with father wounds. This divine masculine, instead of coming in solid, lovers in reverse, ace of coins. He was very unfair towards you and he made a decision to be unfair. And this decision, mm, there's a domino effect here. Come through spirit. Okay, Whew. let's see what's going on. Let's get through it. Oh my goodness. Love is in reverse. He didn't want to cooperate with this contract. Yeah, the sun sideways, he's not happy. He is not happy. He put in a lot of effort to not cooperate. Leo energy, the sun coming out sideways, eight of pentacles. You could have felt like this masculine just started half stepping. Like he was half awake, half awake, half sleep. Virgo energy at the bottom with the hermit. And the six of wands, he didn't know that somebody was secretly plotting his unhappiness. Three of coins, six of wands, and the hermit. There are a group of people that were secretly plotting his unhappiness. He had no, not a wise in reverse. He had no guards up against these people. Come through, spirit. Or these are people that were secretly plotting your unhappiness, divine feminine. He had a moon. Something was deceptive here. What they did in the dark was rejected 
Four of Cups. Somebody wanted to make sure, and we got the sun and the moon here. Mm. We keep seeing that sun moon dynamic. That's also um, feminine and masculine energy. But the masculine energy here is distorted. Yeah, this is a distorted masculine. He was in this deceptive energy. You could have felt like he was wearing a mask, hiding things, keeping a lot of secrets. Pisces, Cancer energy. A lot of major arcanas here. Lovers, the sun, the moon. That could be somebody's top three. Gemini. Somebody's sun could be in Gemini. Okay, or somebody's sun sign could be Pisces, Cancer, Leo, or Gemini, or Libra. Okay, come through. Or somebody's moon is Leo, Gemini, Capricorn, or Libra. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Somebody was a dog. There are three dogs here. Three of Pentacles. These could be three dogs. These could be three dog-ass people. They could have dogged this distorted masculine out. Come through, spirit. Okay. Shoot, I cannot. Okay. These people getting blown up in a tower in the dark. This just blew up in their face. They never saw it coming. Okay. This deception here. There's a lot of deception that came along with this masculine. The moon. Now he's not happy about being deceptive when it came to coming to you solid. What did I just say? He's not happy about being deceptive. Temperance in reverse. Come through, spirit. He's pissed. Sagittarius energy. Because he wasn't solid in a situation here. Now the ten of coins is in reverse. Somebody's falling out with family members. They're isolating from their family members. Big Virgo energy. Hermes showing up again. Yeah. Somebody's pissed off about an opportunity. This, this decision. They should have been fair with a divine feminine with a divine contract here with lovers showing up. These decisions about this opportunity is what brought them here. Ace of coins. Somebody's mad about an opportunity. Temperance in reverse. They're pissed off. Somebody's very emotional. They're, they're out of control. Yeah. Look at that. Divine Feminine, this is your distorted masculine, okay? This is your distorted, uh, not so divine masculine. You showed up as the Queen of Coins and he showed up emotionally out of control. Page of Wands in reverse as the King of Coins in reverse. This masculine is pissed off. Oh, we, somebody trying to save face, but they're really holding back all of this anger, strength, energy. Look how angry. Look how angry this cat is. I mean, like, out of control. Pay. Temperance in reverse. Somebody's like, who are they so angry? They trying to hide it. They're trying to hide it. That's why that sun came out sideways. This is somebody trying to hide it. They're trying to look healed. They're trying to look recovered. Somebody's trying to act like they weren't impacted by something here. But this masculine is out of control. You call judgment on a group of people here. There could be somebody else here is pissed off as well, Divine Feminine. Okay, a karmic lover here could be pissed off as well. Let's see what's going on. You call judgment on this whole situation. Wow. You call judgment and dropped it. Look how the two of coins flew over here into the judgment. When we initially saw judgment, I believe I saw the two of coins in reverse. And it flew all the way over. I'm going to read this two of coins with this judgment card. Two of coins in reverse. You literally dropped this situation. Almost like you feel like this is not an opportunity. This is not solid. Something about this contract wasn't solid here. Yeah, you chose to heal. Not a swords in reverse. You chose, you chose to heal. These decisions that these people made, these karmic energies to assassinate you, this masculine to be one foot in, one foot out of a contract for him to not cooperate with a contract or be very unfair, not show up solid. This did not work out well. Somebody's pissed off that you chose to heal. Now they're trying to figure out how to come towards you. A divine masculine. It's almost like he feel like he can't offer you anything with the page of coins in reverse. Two of Wands and the Emperor, it's like nothing I say is going to be good enough here or something like that. Aries energy. This masculine wants to heal himself. It's like for some of you divine masks, uh, this could, okay. So for some of you guys, uh, this is like uh, the roles are flipped where the masculine is the feminine and the feminine is the masculine. 
And then for some of you guys, you know, the feminine is feminine and the masculine is masculine. Okay, but for me to say that right there, okay, take it how it resonates. There is a masculine who plans on healing himself here. After going through all this, this is what he wants to do. He don't know how to do this, okay? Huh, come through spirit, okay? All right, let's see what else is going on. Cause baby, let's see, let's see. Okay, what else is going on here? Take me over, back over to this assassin. I like somebody literally paid this person. Somebody could get convicted. Give me a card over here. Yeah, they took a risk. Yeah, now it's drama. It's a group of people did this divine feminine. Damn. They took this risk. Look at that. Look at that. It's drama within a coven, within, within a group of karmic feminines. Karmic drama, girl time, and risk. This is me clarifying this assassin energy that somebody patroned somebody to assassinate a chosen one. They had one last chance. Wow. So it was a group. Like I said, Divine Feminine, it was a group. Now they're always fighting. They took this risk. This is a toxic group that wanted to do this towards you. Okay. Come through, spirit. Now this group is scared. Yeah, the fool in reverse, three of cups. Give me three cards over there. Before I get to this other deck. Three cards over there, okay? Yeah, it's action now. Let's see. We got addictions in reverse. We got action. We have soulmates here. This is like a group that could have been obsessed with your soulmates. They took action against this. It's like they wish they didn't Somebody could have even been addicted to spell work here. Somebody could be an addict now. Like somebody's no longer addicted to telling stories about you. If you call judgment, you blew the horn on this entire situation. These people were, there's a group of women that was obsessed with your soul connections. Yeah, they're experiencing nothing but loss. We have loss, RIP. Somebody could be attending a funeral here. This was assassination energy that they were sending towards you. Due to a soulmate situation, because they didn't want, look, makeup, sex, soulmates. This is like they didn't want you to make up with a soulmate or something like that. Divine feminine, take it how it resonates. Damn. These people are ridiculous. Sick. Sick. All these competing where they don't compare, patronizing a cultist from a cultist to a cultist. Reader to reader. This, this, this is sick. There's a karmic male that's out of control here. There's a, a distorted masculine here that's out of control here. Even a warlock here is like, how did this energy stay stuck right here? There's a power struggle. Somebody don't got control anymore. They looking for help? Yeah, they looking for help because they don't have control. They lost control of everything. They lost control of a demon. Like, yeah, a masculine, a toxic karmic masculine lost control of everything social media could be involved. This is their culture. This is why I'm saying it's like, this is what these people do. They got together to do this. We got culture counseling, toxic masculine. It is normal behavior for this distorted masculine to seek this um, karmic masculine or this karmic feminine in a toxic masculine energy to seek advice. This is their culture. There's something wrong with a family dynamic. This is literally their culture. Advice, troubles ahead, shady. Somebody's getting advice from shady people. This what, what is what is wrong with these people? Damn. Your culture is, somebody has, like, their culture is to be a toxic masculine. Yeah, and to be closed off? What? What is going on? Come through, spirit. Okay? Yeah. They didn't have the intuition to protect themselves, or somebody ignored a warning. Yeah, and you called them, you, you blew that horn of judgment on them. Oh, yes, yeah, it's divine family. Yeah, and it paused like the world stopped. Pause. You have the power to stop the world? What? Yeah, you, you had to take a break and call judgment on this empress, star seed. Okay. You stopped it. You stopped it. You so Something is seriously going on with social media. Somebody didn't know their boundaries on social media. Family showing up. Karmic family members stuck on your social media. Stuck on trying to figure out if you getting a love offer. They wanted to see if they stopped your love offer. And make sure you get breadcrumbed. Damn, these people are sick. 
a dark priestess was doing this as well. Somebody crossed boundaries here. My goodness. Last three from this deck? See bar C. Okay, that's three right there. Yeah, soulmates, social media, I'm trying to tell you. It's like they, it, even with social media, it's almost still giving me invasive. We have pacified and seeking guidance. Somebody's like getting an obsessive amount of uh, like uh, readings or something here. Like they're trying to figure out uh, if you and this person still have a contract or something. Somebody's also checking to see if somebody apologized to you yet. They want to know. Somebody like, it's like they want to know if somebody apologized to you yet, Divine Feminine. Okay? Yeah, they want to see if you're still single, if you're free, or if this Divine Masculine is, is like somebody suffering in a bachelor lifestyle or something like that. What? Side note. There's a divine, um, distorted masculine here, not so divine masculine who's suffering, pretending like he's living his best life. He's suffering. He wants to come and apologize. We saw that here too. Something's going on with some money. A feminine's money, a divine feminine's money was frozen. Yeah, whoever froze your money is suffering from a health concern because they were betrayed. After meeting up with this occultist, now they have legal issues or they met up with this assassin, they got legal issues. We got justice here, legal issues. Okay, somebody's having legal issues with a new person that they thought would ride with them. This person won't ride with them. Somebody put themselves first, they took this advice and now they don't know what to do. They took advice from a karmic. We literally have karmic advice. Healthy spirit. Child, what is going on here? <laughs> what is going on? Because I cannot. I don't know how long this reading is because I had to pause it earlier. I had to stop recording earlier. Somebody had plans. Okay, let's see. Take me to this storyteller who took a risk running their mouth about you trying to cover up the fact because they stressed. They're shocked. Everything is changing now. Their story don't add up. Yeah. Healthy spirit. <laughs> this assassin literally came after you. There's a cult, like a group of people with the same culture, some toxic culture. What's going on? These people intentions to divine feminine, what's going on? Okay, we have secret. Secret in reverse and unwelcome. The secret is these people wanted you out of here, divine feminine. With unwelcome, that's the secret. Okay. That's the secret. Okay. The secret is out about how these people wanted you out the way with welcome in reverse. Yeah, they wanted to make sure somebody would suffer and be uncertain about you. They, it's like they were obligated to do this, Divine Feminine. That's how serious they took this mission to get you out the way, to create uncertainty about you. <laughs> okay, Divine Feminine, no wonder you blew the horn on these people. These people were nonstop taking these risks against you. What else is going on with these people's intentions? Yeah, these people were coming in talking about you as if they were doing you a favor. Somebody was acting like they were doing you a favor? This person, somebody was acting like they did you a favor, like they helped you by talking to you or they did you, somebody's weaponizing some kind of favor that you didn't even ask for with unsolicited advice, small favor, big favor, positive. Somebody was acting like they were there for you, divine feminine. Look how big favor, look at that. Come through. Big favor fell out of my hands and it landed in reverse. And look, trick is what revealed itself. This was a trick. I'm trying to tell for some of divine feminine, somebody tried to trap you. Yeah, it wasn't positive for real. It was negative. Okay. Or this divine masculine, this distorted masculine is finding out that it was never them helping him. That this whole time, these people were building a lot of uncertainty because it was all a trick. Because this person was shady. Come through, spirit. What else? What else? Come through. We have growth. Look. I'm trying to tell you, sabotage growth. They were trying, I'm over here, I'm about to come over here. They're literally trying to sabotage this masculine's growth. 
okay? This man is finding out that he sabotaged his own growth. Yeah, that's why now he wants to heal. We talked about how this masculine needed to heal, to have growth, to be unawakened. Because he was unawakened to wake up. Somebody envious, envy is traveling fast. Everybody knows that somebody was envious. This divine masculine could be accusing someone of being envious of him. That's why they were sabotaging his growth. You could have brought growth to a masculine or brought growth to a situation. They wanted to make sure that you wouldn't be able to do this. Their envy is out in the open. Now news is traveling about this, traveling overseas about this, traveling abroad about this. Yeah, or somebody traveled to sabotage something here. A karmic friend with friendly in reverse. Whew. What else? Some more in that section. Yeah, yeah, unfriendly. It was never really a favor. Look at that, we got small favor, unfriendly. This was a setup. Somebody was pretending to help this masculine, pretending to have emotions with imp empathy for this masculine, but it was a joke. They were laughing at this masculine with laugh. This masculine is being laughed at, a distorted masculine who was ungrateful and unappreciative. He's realizing that now. He's, he's the joke, he's the clown. Okay, this is how they're seeing him. He's pissed off. That's why he's in this King of Swords in reverse. He felt like these people are supposed to care for him with obligation and empathy, and they don't. Damn. Yeah, he thought this would be a safe space. Look how that came out, safe space. And they don't. This is being led by sabotage. Wow. Okay. Give me three more of these. Okay, we'll put this over here by this storyteller. This karmic storyteller, karmic friends who are all afraid. Let's see. They're experiencing loss. They're being held down. They're, I mean, damn. They regret revenge. Somebody's venting and yelling about this. Straight up. Look at that. Yelling. Revenge in reverse and venting. They're yelling and screaming about this. They're afraid. Somebody's screaming for help because they trapped themselves with the devil. Somebody realized that they were never supported and that they were being gaslit with support and gaslit showing up. And now this person is stuck in a situation. Yeah, they didn't have the perspective to see the dishonesty with perspective in reverse. Hangman is over here, Pisces energy. Pisces energy talks about perspective. Wow. Take one more. Yeah. And perspective came right out. Somebody's sorry that they didn't see things your way. Didn't I say that here was something about seeing things the way you saw things? Their attitudes about a situation from the past come through spirit has changed. Perspective in reverse, I'm sorry. Somebody sorry they didn't see it your way. This person gaslit you. Somebody got gaslit into giving somebody a loan? Shoot, damn. Okay, let's see what else is going on because baby, baby, damn. Okay, for the extended reading for this, we are just going to keep going because baby, this is a lot. This is a lot going on, okay? We are going to close this out. This is a lot going on. This assassin energy, somebody regrets this, okay? I'm gonna do a couple of more cards and we are going to close this out and go into the extended reading. We're just gonna continue where we left off and see how this plays out because these people are yelling at each other. Somebody feels ghastly, come through spirit. Yeah, by a secret society, they thought that this group was like trying to give them a gift. Somebody was promised something from a group of people, a karmic masculine was promised something from a group of people or a distorted or not so divine masculine was promised something from a group of people, a secret society. Cause I'm telling you divine, this is their culture. What else? Come through spirit. Yeah, these people are, these people are trying to run an organized crime uh, ring or something like that with travel, organized crime in reverse. It's like they found out that these people, somebody could have tried to 
yeah, if somebody could have traveled your way to commit a crime against you, but you weren't there, they were stopped in their tracks with frozen timeline issue, cover up in reverse. I'm telling you, Divine Feminine, there could be notes that are discovered with your name and your address and you just get like a well check out of nowhere or you find out sometime in the future that there is like a, a crime, like some kind of, I don't know why I'm getting this, like a raid on a criminal or something or they find paperwork that looks like somebody was paid to take you out in some capacity, whether that is spiritually or physically and it leads to somebody reaching out to you for a well check or to see if you okay. This could even be somebody just hitting you up. Hey, you good? And and they don't tell you why they why they ask you that. And you could be like, why why are you asking me this? Yeah, they trying to make sure somebody. You know, it's like somebody could literally be checking on you to make sure you can get, didn't get caught up in a firestorm because they found notes of somebody paying someone to do this to trap you to trap your power. But they trap themselves. Come through, spirit. What is going on here? A couple more of these. I'm going to get to the zodiac signs. Yeah, somebody doesn't have influence anymore. They can't manipulate anymore. They're not affluent. Somebody fell off of their high horse. Yeah, they don't have their power supply anymore. Somebody's a narcissist. We got neglect, abuse, and power supply. You could have been a narcissist power supply, Divine Feminine. Like they were using you as a power supply or somebody was using this uh, distorted masculine as a power supply. They could manipulate and attack a partnership through this masculine's energy with market manipulation and couple in reverse. Somebody's always able to manipulate partnerships here or something like that. Come through, Spirit. What else? Now somebody is left alone by themselves. They're in a deep state, stuck, frozen in a portal. Somebody communication can't get through. Somebody tried to communicate with the dead, okay? With burial and communication in reverse. Damn, they could have communicated with something else. Okay. A couple more of these and then we're done. Okay, we're gonna go to the extended reading and see how this plays out. Yeah, death energy, Scorpio energy showing up. There could be a, like a, I'm telling you, like there's information about a death or an ending or surveillance of a death. Somebody could have, somebody could be caught on camera trying to commit a homicide or there's information about this. Or somebody's seen their own death. Yeah, this information is spreading around. Somebody sent false information with Operation Mockingbird and no, or something is not fake. This is real. What these people were trying to do to you is real? Okay. Let's see. Yeah, AI in reverse. It's real. AI in reverse. Yes, it's real. Like I said, yeah, break up in reverse. They could never break you. Come through, spirit. They could never. Let's get to the zodiac signs, you guys. Okay? In the extended reading, we're just going to go on and see where this goes. Okay? I'm going to pull more of my... Uh, we're going to get more on the intentions. Okay? We're going to pull more of the high-level energies as well. We're going to see what's going on with this masculine next, this distorted masculine. Because we know he's pissed off right here. And we know he got plans. So we're going to find out what those plans are. Okay, let's see what signs are involved here. Gemini energy, sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, node. Okay, mm. seventh house placement. Cancer energy in reverse. That Gemini partnership energy was in reverse, immersed. Somebody is not like in this, in a situation like that anymore. Somebody's not emotionally invested in a situation anymore. Okay, April 30th could be significant here. April 3rd, April 13th, March 14th, March 4th. March 5th, Hunter Spirit. What else is going on? What else? Okay, Gemini Cancer Energy, Scorpio Energy, Investigate is here. Somebody, there's somebody's in the middle of an investigation. They're about to find the truth out about a situation. August 4th could be significant here. April 8th could be significant here. April 4th, somebody could be 48. Somebody could be born in 84. Come through, Spirit. 31 could be significant here. December could be significant here. Let's see. November, 8th house could be significant here. 
Okay. We got Venus energy, Taurus energy is here. Somebody's investigating a love situation. Yeah, it's under review. We got review retrograde energy showing up here. August 21st could be significant here. March 8th, March 21st, April 21st, February 1st, February 2nd, February 28th, 24th, February 4th. Let's see. Somebody could be seeing 444. Too many cards. I want to take those all at the same time. So what we got? Gemini. We got Cancer. We got Taurus. We got Scorpio energy. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node. Could be your sign, my masculine sign, one of the karmic sign. Okay, let's see. What else? Aries energy showing up. Review. That review energy is here. Action. Act. Double on the Aries. This is being reviewed. There's an investigation going on here. Investigating a partnership. Investigating somebody that they love. There's an investigation. Somebody's investigating love. June 21st, June 8th, June 4th, June 12th, June 13th. May 21st, May 8th, May 29th, May 4th. Let's see here. 16 could be significant here. March 16th, August 16th could be significant here. 512-515 could be significant. Phone numbers, addresses, 821, okay. 4821 could be significant. 4831, 3121. All right, let's see. What other signs here? Pisces energy, 12 could be significant. The number three, 315, December 15, 21st, 8th, 4th, December 31st. New Year's Eve could be significant here. Something significant happened around New Year's Eve. Somebody sensitive now. They reviewed something and now it's like, whoa, what's going on? 15, 12 could be significant here. Let's see what other signs are involved here. Let's get two more. Okay, we got Sagittarius energy showing up. September 3rd, September 13th, September 4th, 8th, September 12th, September 21st, September 15th. Come through. December 9th. Okay, June 9th, August 9th. Okay, so my 94 could be significant here. 93, 89 could be significant here. Virgo energy, somebody, uh, hmm, somebody could be losing weight here. They can't eat. Somebody having like some kind of gastro issue. Yeah, they're uncomfortable. Somebody can't really eat too well here. Somebody could be um, ill. 96 could be significant here. September 6th. 86, 46, 68, 69 could be significant here. Somebody definitely is like uncomfortable. Somebody sick to their stomach. They're very uncomfortable here. Yeah. Somebody could, there could be something going on with some kind of gastro. So I could have an allergic reaction to some food recently or something like that. Okay. Let's see what else is going on here. What is the sign? One more. That's double on the... Um, actually, Mars didn't actually come out. So, let's see. Actually, no, no, no. Aries didn't come out. Mars... Aries came out, but Mars didn't come out. Okay. So, something is in motion. This review is in motion. This Mars energy talks about motion. Somebody's reviewing a mystery. I'm telling you, there's a case being solved. We solved the case here. You guys might hear about this. This is directly related to you or this is a side message. We done solved the case here. I'm trying to tell you. We have Mars. This talks about motion review and a mystery. We're cracking a code here. Come through, spirit. There's motion here. 2215 could be significant. So I could be seeing 22226. Eighth house energy. Didn't I say eighth house energy could be significant here? That's more Scorpio energy here. Come through, spirit. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna take what's at the bottom. Okay, more Scorpio energy. There's a rebirth in reverse. So this situation is not going to change. This is how this situation is going down with rebirth in reverse. So there could be, someone could be seeing 666. Mark of the Beast could be significant here. 999, 333 three, three as well. Okay, there could be a Gemini Cancer Scorpio, double Scorpio, could be literal twins involved. Tories, uh, two masculines could be involved. Aries, 
Pisces, actually triple Scorpio. Wow, didn't I say a lot of Scorpio was strong in the beginning of the reading, strong at the end too. Triple Scorpio, Sagittarius, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Seventh House, Placement. Whew, okay you guys. Oh my God, that was your reading. I am going over to the extended reading. We are gonna pick up this masculine's plans, where does this where does this ultimately lead? Okay, we're going to continue. Like I said, just through throughout through we're gonna continue out this reading. Whew, get my tongue together. Okay, you guys, thank you so much. Put all your comments below. Let me know how this resonates with you. I read all my comments. So put all your comments below and let me know how this resonates with you. Premium members, as usual, you get free access to all my extended readings. Non-premium members, there is a link there for you. Make sure you are subscribed, you guys. So make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you hit the thumbs up. Share the video. That's how YouTube knows you love my content. That's how I know you love my content when you share my videos. And with that said, I am going to the extended reading. I will catch you guys later. Bye. Continue.